Hello everybody and welcome to the Aqueous Firefly Pulling Extravaganza. Today we have the absolute perfect place to do these pulls here for Firefly. All right, we are on Blade, a destruction character, in front of the Calyx of Destruction, okay? Also, we are in between the seas that Don Hung and Bibita Lune, yes, a destruction character, parted. We are ready to do these pulls. There is no better place. There is no better location for any better luck. And we will pull Firefly. I can guarantee it. We have 99, we have 95 pulls. And if you don't know this, all right, hopefully this doesn't ruin any excitement. It probably will a little bit, but we're going to be doing the light cone pulls as well. Um, and we might even pull for an Eidolon depending on how fast we get Firefly. We already lost the 50-50. All right, we did. Yeah, so let's Let's have uh, no further ado. Uh, without further ado, uh, let's get into the pulls. We are pulling till we have zero pulls left. Zero. All right, so let's do it. Will we get it? We didn't get it off the first 10 pull. We didn't get it off the first 10 pull. But that's fine. That's fine. Honestly, the characters on this banner, the four stars, aren't that bad. They're really not. So we have an edible promise, an ed, an ed, whatever it is. We have promise. Uh, Gallagher, I don't know if we have all the Eidolons. I think we do, actually, because it just gave us 20. Uh, Stardust. So that's fine. We got a Gallagher, and we got uh, a Luke Eidolon. Getting the extra Stardust is good for us, of course. Oh my god, another 10 pull. Not getting the character. <laughs> This is rough. This is rough. Already down to 75 pulls. I don't know how much further we can go here. We may be reaching, reaching the end of our rope. No, we got this. We got this in the bag. Um, the light cone banner is going to be quite a bit scary. As, uh... It's not 100% like it is on Wuthering Waves. There we go. We get the 5 star. I think we won the 50-50 already at one point. I guess we're going to find out right now. If we didn't, that is going to be a very, very rude awakening. But I'm 99% sure. Last time we did pulls. Because I said, I'll throw in I'll throw in a few for adventuring. If we get them, we get them. If we don't, we don't. We ended up getting a character and we got... Yep, we got Chapard. So there's Firefly. She's on the account. Easy dub. Easiest W of my life. Okay, easy as W of our lives. 100%. And I'm pretty sure we went all the way to pity here for this character. Because, uh, yeah, I mean, we did have a, a decent amount of pulls on this banner. So, now for the light cone. Shall we read what the light cone does? I can't tell you enough, I swear. I did not read what the light cone does. So it increases the wearer's break effect by 60%. That's really good, of course. When the wearer deals break damage to an enemy target, inflicts routed on the enemy, lasting for two turns. Okay, so once it breaks or inflicts routed, targets afflicted with routed receive 24% increased break damage from the wearer, and their speed is lowered to, by 20%. Okay, so that's a, that's a pretty decent um, uh, light cone. I feel like I need it because I don't know if my break effect is going to be that great. Um... Of course, I don't need it, need it, but like, a break effect isn't going to be that great. So, we're going to pull for it. We're going to go for it. Let's see if we get lucky. With Acheron, we received her, winning the 50-50. We got her again to make her E1, where we won the 50-50. We got her again, making her E2, and we won the 50-50. And then we went, and we pulled for her light cone, and we won the 75-25. We'd never stopped winning. It was just win after win after win. It was insane. One of the, by far, most insane poll videos I have ever done. And if you just want to watch an insane poll video, I would suggest go watching that. Right now, oh my god. We're receiving a lot of day one of my new lives. I think that's actually a pretty decent light cone, is it not? I'm like 99% sure I remember that. Being a really good one. The transfer battle is just... Yeah, I mean, that's alright. It's okay. It's okay. 
it's okay. We, we would definitely prefer maybe getting a five star like on here. You know, that's an idea. Um, but hey, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? We're not having good luck. At least we're getting a bunch of uh, Starlight, which we're going to use a lot of the Undying Starlight that we get to probably buy more pulls, if I'm being honest. Let's go again. 40 pulls. Oof. Fourth 10 pull in the bin. This is rough. This is very scary. I don't think we're going to have enough to pull for Eidolons. I really don't. If not, that's fine. If not, it's fine. A character that I do definitely want to pull as many copies of as possible is the character that works really well with Acheron. Because I just want Acheron. Oh, well, I would prefer Firefly, but I don't know if Firefly is Acheron's damage level. Can anybody confirm or deny that? I have no idea. I really have not been watching a lot of content because I've been focusing on the move. So, I'm going to be focusing on everything moving related and doing all that and trying to do as much as I can on that front. I have not been paying attention to games at all. In fact, I don't even know what people are saying about this light cone. People could be saying, wow, this is one of the worst premium light cones we've ever had offered to us. Never go for this. I would have no idea. I really wouldn't. I'd have no idea. Until I watch a video, I want, until I watch like Braxophone's guide after I finish making this video by pulling for Firefly, and then uh, I just have, um, I just get blasted with, yeah, if you pull this light cone, you're an idiot. I have no idea. But I would imagine it's pretty good, right? Obviously, like, why would that not be good? Texture's all about break effect. Okay, there we go. There we go. With our last pen pull we could possibly do on the account without going into our starlight, we have the light cone. We have a light cone. I don't know if we have the light cone. If we don't have the light cone, I'm actually going to be extremely, extremely sad. 75% chance. That's a good chance, guys. All right? I'm honestly kind of scared. I'm on I'm I'm honestly scared. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Oh yeah. We could double up. No, we won't though. We won't though. Alright. Hell yeah. We got her and her light gun. That is amazing. What is what what does her Eidolon say exactly? Like let, let's just go. Let's just go to our character. Let's read what the Eidolon is and let's decide whether or not we want to blow a bunch of undying starlight to pull for her. Okay? Let's see. Let's equip her. My girl. Hell yeah. This is very, very exciting. I am legit so excited to build to build this character. Um, what are we doing? Oh, oh, we're gonna look at our Eidolons. When using the enhanced skill, it ignores 15% of the target's defense. The enhanced skill does not consume skill points. What? Wait, that might be one of the strongest E1s, unless I'm an idiot. Unless I simply don't know how the game works. That might be the strongest E1s ever. Ignores 15% of the target's defense. So just straight up deals like 15% more damage by shredding the target's defense. And it doesn't consume skill points. Like that's so good. Because here's the thing, you don't want to use Sparkle with Firefly, exactly. Because like because you want to use Ruan Mei and you want to use Harmony MC. Then you probably want to use a uh, an abundance character or, or a preservation. And then what's her E2? While in complete combustion, using the enhanced basic attack or enhanced skill to defeat an enemy or target 
or break their weakness allows Sam to immediately gain one extra turn. Wow. So whenever Firefly kills something, it's an extra turn. Wow. That's pretty good. That is really good, actually. Hmm. Shall we? Shall we? Shall we, guys? Are we making a poor choice? Let's see. No, let's see. What? Braxophone has to say about it. Let's see. Honestly. There we go. Amongst a vast and diverse sea of topics exists one path where everything converges. Mecha anime. Not only are there incredibly popular series such as Evangelion that you find crossing over with those if you're actually going to get some and she can see the money in your wallet. Which ignores from characters and her relic set. Okay, here we go. Defense is still going to go over what her Eidolons do. First off, Ewan is just a solid damage jump with 15% defense ignore on her enhanced skill that stacks up with other defense ignores from characters and her relic set. But it's also a saved skill point for every single enhanced skill. This basically makes it so that you can play Firefly with Branya without any issues for skill points, which makes her teams a lot more flexible too. But once you have E1, E2 actually looks insane because it gives Sam an extra turn after breaking or defeating an enemy with an enhanced basic or skill, which adds a ridiculous ridiculous amount of damage potential to Firefly as a whole. Oh my god. Turn, so you can't chain it forever, but if played in a perfect scenario... Hey, you've convinced me. You've convinced me, bro. You've convinced me. What can I say? I'm easily swayed. I am. I'm easily swayed. Why the hell do we do that again? Oh yeah, we can go here. And we can exchange. So I actually do have enough for one of the uh one of these, but like who needs it? Who needs it when I can get 30 passes? Oh god, I just did that. Okay, 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 okay. 30 pulls. 30 pulls. These could be going straight into the abyss. 30 pulls. I chose Possibly three ten pulls that don't give me a single five star or anything. Or a guaranteed, you know, when I could have had a guaranteed five star light cone. So let's just see how this goes. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. It might be doomed. It really might be doomed. Well, we got the Misha. Thank God. I love playing Misha. One more. Oh, no. Oh, man. With whatever starlight that we get out of this, we'll do a few singles, but I think we're done. I think we're done, guys. I think we've hit the end of the road. A lot of starlight right there. Oh, we also have the five pulls from the other one. Let's do it. Let's do that. Okay. So we get three more pulls from here. We get five more pulls from here. We have five more standard pulls. Let's grab these. Okay. 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 Let's do it. Eight single pulls. It is so unlikely. It is so unlikely. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, 
Oh god. Only two more left. Damn. That was really rough. It looks like we're probably not going to get it. Let's do some standard pulls. We have 16 of them. I'm honestly just going to skip. That's probably what I should have done anyway. For the 10 pulls. With all the dust from the 4 stars that I'm getting here, I'm going to be able to get one mower through the Undying Starlight. I know. I'm a freak of zone. I'm a freak of nature. How do I do it? Sometimes I don't even know. <sighs> the last possible pull my account could ever do. Right here. Damn. Well. What's this? Oh. Oh. Well, thank you all for watching. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, I'm sorry. It's all my fault. I didn't get a million more fire. I, I didn't get two fireflies at least. It's all my fault. I should have broke out the 401k. No, my wallet could never take that. Uh, my wallet cannot take that at all right now. Thank you all for watching. Uh, subscribe, and uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Peace.